what up guys uh are you kind of disappointed in bitcoin's performance lately because if you are i am too uh yeah we just got the bitcoin etf approved and i think everyone kind of knew that it was going to be a buy the rumor sell the news event but i don't think we're actually ready for it to happen but it did but that's not why we're here today today we're going to be going over a new uh kapow based gpu mineable coin it's not even that big there's only like five six hundred miners on the coin total right now so rewards are going to still be pretty good for the coin i'm going to go through show you how you set it up on windows and hive os we're also going to be talking about the importance of amd gpus coming up for this next bull run because these kapow based algorithms have been popping off like relatively hard and so i'm going to go over just a couple amd gpus i'm thinking about picking up over the course of the next bull run and why these gpus in particular i plan on picking them up in the next bull run oh well, during this next bull run and so yeah like always please like and subscribe we're trying to get to 200 subscribers so we can go ahead and get uh monetized already and also don't forget to check out the links down below in the description they'll make you some money they'll make me some money yeah let's get into it Okay, so the new GPU mineable coin that's not been out that long is called Crypto Luck. It's still like super new. Uh, I don't think there's like a lot of developers or a lot of hardcore developers on it. So that's kind of interesting. As you guys can see, their logo is still pretty bland. Uh, they've been definitely posting up on Twitter and stuff. Uh, kind of not the most, but yeah, this is their logo still kind of half half a uh, half done uh but yeah so there's really still super new project which in my opinion is a good time to mine a little bag of it because if it gets listed on some more reputable like S zedgex and or trade ogre it could pop off uh currently it said it's been listed on here for 15 days but i checked this every day and found it last night we only have a total network hash rate of 151 giga hash which is not a lot whatsoever if we come over here to uh we're over on mining pool uh mining pool stats dot stream uh it does say over here that they are listed over on finance x dot trade but i don't use this exchange nor do i trust this exchange it currently says that there's only almost two grand in 24 hour volume which means this coin is still really new and that's always really good uh a little bit concerning because if you do come over to their website it is definitely half uh not not the most professional looking crypto website on the planet but it is really new and what we're looking for is if they actually build this out make it a better looking website better ui and all that then yeah that's kind of what you want from a project but essentially what crypto luck is it is uh supposed to be like a mineable gambling coin <laughs> kind of interesting that is definitely a narrative that could pop off during the bull run decentralized gambling has been pretty big uh in the crypto scene for a while so yeah you never know what'll happen of it but yeah currently they have two games crash and mines kind of like the minesweeper game i don't know what crash is essentially you can come over to their website you'll log in sign up you can use the crypto that you mine to test out some of these games i'm probably not going to be doing that but yeah quite interesting but we're not here for that we're here to mine it so we're going to come back over here to mining pool streams and we're going to use our favorite pool, uh, our plant. We're going to go over to our plant. We're going to hit connect. Before you do that, you're going to want to come over to their website. Go to CL blockchain over on the side. You will find their wallet right here. Always be careful when downloading wallets on your machines because it could have some, uh, some bad acting software that can definitely junk up your stuff so always make sure you download it into a folder that's 
locked away from the rest of your PC or in a VM. However you decide to do it, just be very careful with these random wallets. But you're going to click on the wallet once you get once you get it downloaded. You're going to go through. I don't have it open. Open up the wallet. It's going to go ahead, do the thing, sync to the network. If you've downloaded crypto wallets before, this isn't going to be new to you. You go over to receive. Oh, yeah. You're going to go to file, receiving address, hit new, label your address. You'll get your address. You'll click on it. You'll copy it. And then once you have your address, you don't really need the wallet anymore. Well, I mean, you still need the wallet, but not for what we're doing now. You're going to come over to our plat, our plant, hit connect, choose miner. I personally always use T-Rex miner. It's my favorite miner. It's, it's uh, at least for AMD GPUs. If you do have something like an uh, NVIDIA. So yeah, for NVIDIA GPUs, T-Rex, if you're using something like a AMD GV, GPU, multi-rig and or BRZ. BZ miner, not BRZ, it's not a Subaru. Sorry guys, it's super early in the goddamn morning and I wanna go back to bed, but I gotta make this video. So T-Rex miner, we're mining on Windows, America, and this stuff will still be, uh, you'll still need to do this step, even if you're doing it on Hive OS, just because you'll need this stratum, but we'll get to that. Do your worker name, I don't use SSL. So now that we have our our command, we're going to come over to our miners and we're using T-Rex. You're just going to copy. I'm just going to copy a random one, go through, rename it crypto luck or a uh, trash coin, whatever you want to call it. You're going to go to edit. And then this middle line of the batch file, we're going to replace gonna come over here you're gonna grab where it starts at trex.exe all the way down to the end of your worker name copy it once you have that copied you'll come here all the way down to the end of your worker name and then you'll paste it and then once you get that pasted you'll just go ahead file save get that saved and then you're off to run and that's how you get it set up for Windows. Now for Hive OS, it's just as easy as you guys can see. I have my little AMD rig on it right now, getting around 59 mega hash at 253 watts, which I think is really good and pretty efficient for an AMD card. But what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna come over here, hit add wallet, type in coin, and then this one is C-R-Y-P-T-O-L-U-C-K, crypto look. You're gonna hit create coin into your wallet address, name it, whether you want to call it desktop GUI, trash coin wallet, whatever, go ahead, name it. Once you have that named, I'll come over to flight sheets and then you'll go to the crypto luck. Oh, I have to go into my farm where I already made it. Okay. Yeah. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. Trying to get the 200 subscribers. Also, comment down below if you guys already have AMD G yeah, AMD GPUs. If you guys are planning on getting more AMD GPUs. Also, what coins are you guys mining that you plan on popping off for the bull run? I want to hear your opinions. Just because, like, I'm trying to stack all the coins possible. But uh, you're gonna come in here, coin crypto luck. You're gonna add your wallet. Pull. We're gonna configure in miner. For my AMD GPUs, we're going to use uh, Team Red Miner because that is my favorite. And then algorithm is going to be Kapow because it's a Kapow coin. You're going to do wallet.worker, worker name, password, whatever you would like it to be. And then that stratum we created earlier. You're going to come copy that just down to the 7106. You're going to hit copy. 
you'll paste that into there. You'll hit apply changes. You'll name it. As you guys can see, I have my named crypto luck AMD because it's for my AMD rigs. And then you'll name it and create flight sheet. There. Now you guys are, are up and ready to mine crypto luck in both Windows and Hive OS. And for you guys who decided to stay this long for the important part of the video, uh, next we're going to go over the importance of AMD GPUs. So if you come over here, back over to mining pool stats, you can see a lot of these coins on this Kapow, in this Kapow channel have popped off. AI Power Grid has been super profitable for a couple of weeks now. Nur AI had a really nice pop off in exchange listing last year. Clore.ai, if you mined this coin last year, you would have made some really nice profits like DJ Mines, I believe, like banked out on this coin. Uh, Neoxa is definitely a big banger coming up in the next bull run. It's a play to earn uh, deep in crypto gaming coin, really nice coin. And Sato X is trying to do a similar thing. And then we have the good old Raven coin. I could definitely see Raven coin coming back in the next bull run just because people always want to buy on those old OG coins. And Raven coin is definitely one of them. So the AMD GPUs I'm thinking about picking up and why is going to be. So for one, I want another one of these 5700 XTs. They're some of the most beautiful graphics cards I have ever seen. Uh, these will look really good in budget PCs after the bull market. Also, the 6800 is definitely a really good reputable GPU. Uh, it's supposed to be good at 4K gaming, 16 gigabytes of memory. So after the bull run, throwing this in a gaming PC and flipping it is definitely going to be definitely feasible. And if you've already made your money back on the GPU, that the PC sell afterwards is just going to be extra money. Another one I'm looking at picking up just for efficiency. This one's probably not going to be the best for trying to flip gaming PCs just because it is a lower end AMD GPU. But as far as mining goes, these are super efficient. So you can like stack a farm full of them. And yeah, so this one's really good. Another one I'm also looking at is the 6600 XT. This one is both efficient and will be great in budget PCs. If you guys have, haven't gathered right now, part of my plan for this crypto bull run is to mine make gains, turn that into hardware, mine on that hardware. And then at the end of the bull run, just go ahead, read thermal paste, clean them up, replace fans, do all the goodness, and then sell them in gaming PCs just to make more money on my gains from the bull run. I will have all these GPUs linked down in the description. I would definitely recommend picking up more AMD GPUs just to mine on because of how profitable Kapow based coins have been lately. But yeah, so that's how to mine crypto luck, mine it at your own discretion. Uh, yeah, we will see what happens. Also stay tuned for my video on the update for vish.ai. That's going to be coming out probably later today. Uh, yeah, quite interesting. But yeah, that's crypto luck. That's why you need more AMD GPUs. Go ahead, like, subscribe. Uh, don't forget to check out the links down below in the description, comment what coins you guys were looking at and help us get to 200 subscribers. This is the end of the video. Peace out.